I would say that in many ways, uh, my life itself has become very pregnant in silence and very simple. And I think Zen looks to strip away all that things aren't and provide the, the, the innocent, simple clarity of what is. And so in that way, with that understanding of Zen, that comes into all that I do. Mm -hmm. uh, so usually when I work with people, there's an innocence that is restored. There's a simplicity that becomes a strong part of their life. Mm -hmm. I've found for myself the the Zen sort of space when um, you reach it and it becomes sort of like a constant that even that space can be quite ecstatic because when you're in that space, then you actually are in the flow of the divine and in accord with the universe and all universal plans and everything becomes synchronous. It's quite quite wild how many um, coincidences seem to happen over and over. <laughs> I agree. I agree. I agree. I love the way that you put that as well. <laughs> <laughs> how do you balance the line between work and play in your life? Well, because all I do is about this, play is naturally a part of it. 